In the 27th of September 2024, Autolytics has released the newest version of YOLO, which is YOLO V11. In the documentation, it was said that they bring some key features. Enhanced feature extraction. Faster and more efficient. Higher accuracy with less parameter. Adaptive to different environments and support more computer vision tasks. Well, now let us see how this new model detection performance compared to previous models. Before that, click subscribe and ring the bell to get updates on YOLO and computer vision. In the daylight video, the detection results of YOLO V11 and V8 are almost the same, whereas the YOLO V10 often fails to detect some objects. YOLO V9 has better results compared to other models because it can detect this person object. Besides that, YOLO V11, V10, and V8 occasionally detect cars as trucks. The most stable is YOLO V9. In the low light video, YOLO V11 and V10 often detect the train object with a fairly high confidence value even though there is no train object in the video. YOLO V11 also often detects road barriers as a person. YOLO V8, V9, and V11 quite often detect boards as trucks. The least frequent is YOLO V10. In this video, YOLO V10 and V8 detect field lights as chairs. Apart from chairs, YOLO V11 and YOLO V9 can detect bends as well. Meanwhile, YOLO V8 and YOLO V10 can only detect one bends. In a blurry video with fast moving objects, YOLO V11 performs better than the other models because in this frame, YOLO V11 can detect this person object. Besides that, YOLO V9 often detects the frisbee object even though it is not a frisbee. In the videos with many objects, YOLO V10 often fails to detect those objects. YOLO V11 successfully detects objects that other models cannot. That is the tie object. In summary, YOLO V11 is good at detecting small objects, but performs poorly in low-light conditions. While YOLO V10 struggles with both many objects and low-light conditions. YOLO V8 and V9 are relatively more stable compared to the other models. At the end, the choice is yours. Choose the version that gives best performance on your project. If you like the video, just hit the thumbs up and the share button. If you have any question, please feel free to put it in the comment. Thank you and see you next time.